Oh yeah, I wanted to bring you guys this awesome glitter, super glittery, shimmery um, bronze look today. Um, I really, really love it and I cannot wait to wear it to a party or something. I mean, oh, it's like glitter cast. Like, it really, really is. So, um, I hope you guys keep watching. It's super glittery and I, I really, really love it. Um, so I hope you guys keep watching and, um, find out, you know, to find out what I used and how I did it and all stuff like that. And yeah, keep watching. Alright, so today I'm going to start with a base. And this is from Shiseido. And it's called, I'm not sure what it's called. But it's called, the color is Gold Lights. And it's, okay, it's a cream shadow. But when you put it on your lids, it turns into an eyeshadow, like, um, you know, a powder one. It's really cool and super shimmery and awesome. On like that. You guys see the color? It's really, really gorgeous. Um, putting it onto the lid, into the inner corner. And I'm also going to put it a little above into the crease. Max Coca Motion. Um, you can't see that. It's awesome. It's like wood winked in like powder pigment form with sparklies in it it's awesome I love it so I'm gonna apply that on wet and I'm taking this brush no <laughs> okay cake eyeliner sealer by Napoleon Pardee I'm um, just because I'm running low on um, fix plus and I don't want to use that right now and just press it and then also blend it a bit. Just blend out all the little lumps because that's what happens. It gets kind of clumpy. Um, pigments do um, by MAC. Um, or any pigments, I would say. It gets kind of lumpy um, when you wet it. So, but it's not a big deal. So I want to darken up the crease like I did right here. And I'm going to take also, like, I always use this, okay? It's this. It's in my Spice Chocolate Quad. It's Spice Chocolate. <sighs> Sorry. Um, it's a matte brown, any dark matte brown that you want. Put it in there. And I'm taking this crease brush, and someone asked me what this was, and this is from Coastal Sense. It's the round, it's the Badger Round Crease Brush or something. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in there. Like that. Starting lightly. You always start lightly, right? And, um, what do we do? We make love to the outer crease. And the outer V. So just hug it. And just make, you know, just keep tracing that back and forth. To blend it out. Now, if you don't like shimmer and glitter, stay away from this look. Now I'm going to be adding a little bit of black. And I'm using Carbon by MAC. It's a matte black. And I'm just going to add a little bit of that just to deepen this brown out. Take Soba by MAC, which is a really um, goldy brown color. It's this one right there. And I'm just going to blend that out um, with my 224. I'm going to blend out the... Um, the crease color that we just put in there and that's not going to mess around with the gold it's going to be fine so just do that okay really exciting this is the second product i've hit pan on okay it's um what is this blanc type by mac i'm grabbing that with my elf brush and i'm taking some i'm so proud of myself guys i'm so proud and i'm going to put that as my highlight get rid of that but okay one thing so um i'm going to wet my brush a little bit with fix plus just a little bit this is just a fluffy brush and i'm just gonna spray spritz it okay really really lightly i'm taking reflex bronze which looks like this gorgeous little thing and i'm just gonna take some off the cap because cap has tons 
and I'm going to go ahead and put that on top and this is just added glitter I love glitter I am a glitter maniac I really am anytime I can add glitter I will and I don't know that's just what I do that's how I do I do me I do me and I'm going to line my eye as you can see I did wing it out and it's a pretty thick line and I'm going to use my all-time favorite liquid liner and it's Urban Decay liquid liner so I'll be back all right so I'm applying my favorite mascara it's called L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black. I also like the regular Voluminous one. Um, so I don't have a preference between the two, but this is good too. And I always apply tons of mascara. I really do not play when it comes to my mascara. Like, I love my lashes really, really dark on days that I have makeup on. So, I like wear makeup almost every day, so I don't know why I say on days that I have makeup on. I'm doing the bottoms lightly. I don't put a ton on the, on those. And it looks, you know, it looks like that. So I'm contour, bring it up like so. And we're just going to bring that in here. Blend down right and I don't put a lot on because I'm so fair that it'll look crazy on me why do I you know I treat myself seeing Mac um this is dainty blush and it's a salmon colored blush with these gold sparkles you can see them right there and I have glitter fallout excuse it but I'm not going to wipe it away right now because I don't want it. Okay, we're going to nude out the lips with Flash Pop by MAC. And it's just, you know, it's kind of like myth except it has more of a, a pink undertone. Like that. And you put concealer on. Whatever. And the Glam 5. That's gonna go. There we go. Which looks like that. It's a pretty color. Put that on top. Like that. I'm gonna grab more of vanilla pigments. I love vanilla pigment. Just gonna give it a nice gold sheen. And nude it out just a little bit more. See? It's just like, it's all in the cap, and I just, it's like, comes out like that. I don't like that at all. Like, come on. A girl doesn't need extra mess in her makeup station, her makeup bag. The thing can get everywhere. And I'm just... Anyway, um, this is the finished look. I hope that you guys like it. Let me zoom you in on the eye. Let me see. Very, very, very sparkly, glamour, bronzed eyes. I mean, it's gorgeous. And let me know if you like my new lighting. I did, um, is that all? Oh, oh that's as zoomed out as I can get. And yeah, just let me know if you guys like this look. And I hope that you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. And um, I'll see you guys more soon. Bye.